welcome to Hostage Square Tel Aviv, where tonight thousands of people are now making their way home following a very moving ceremony. As is Jewish tradition, days of remembrance begin at sundown and they continue till sundown the next day. So tonight after sundown, there was a beautiful ceremony here to remember Holocaust Memorial Day. There are normally services all up and down the countryside, at military bases, at schools and public places, but this year things are a little bit quieter. There is more of a sadness because gathered in the square behind me are many families who are missing loved ones who have suffered in the second Holocaust, the one that took place here on October 7th. Behind me there are representatives of families who have not seen their loved ones for nearly seven months. They don't know if they're alive, they don't know if they're being well treated, all evidence suggests not. So tonight we pray for the hostages, at the same time remembering those six million who died in the Holocaust during the Second World War. We remember them because the world said never again, and yet it's happened. Such horrific events were wreaked upon the people of Israel on October the 7th, and summarily all the world can do is try to justify it. Tonight we remember the Holocaust of the Second World War, but also another shore on October the 7th. We will also remember on which side of history we stood. Bryce Turner, Tel Aviv.